Anyway, uh, Washington state law requires the city manager to faithfully uh, execute all laws uh, and ordinances. Um, this was put in place, you know, uh, so that the, the laws that you folks pass are actually executed and, and it will actually wind up making this uh, town a lot more desirable and a safer place to live. It also requires that the city council be kept informed uh, on the financial condition of the city. You know, there's hundreds of thousands of dollars that I believe that are unaccounted for. Uh, there's projects, um, you know, such as the annexation boards, uh, business development projects that never materialized. All of these are not uh, showing up on these uh, quarterly status reports uh, that you folks are receiving. I think that if they were there, that we would wind up having a little bit more insight into what is actually happening and probably have a lot less of me up here. Um, also, it requires that the, uh, that the council be provided uh, information on council requests. And this has been a hot topic uh, for quite a while. And there is much that could be resolved if um, the um, proposals that I've got in this uh, information pack that I've given to the city clerk are followed. Because what it'll do is give a uh, set of information that everybody can judge, um, you know, yay or nay on that. Um, and also, I do believe it is time to look for a new city manager, and I propose that we uh, wind up paying $2,000 a month more to get uh, someone the caliber of a Mercer Island city manager. You know, a person like this is not going to come just for the money. They're going to want to make sure that all the pieces are in line, you know, with the council. And, um, and also, they all will wind up uh, taking on a large backlog. Uh, of uh, projects uh, that need to um, be um, addressed, as well as they're going to be uh, needing your support uh, to turn the city around. Um, I've also, uh, as I mentioned earlier, attached uh, a much more in-depth uh, copy um, with Monica. Um, this uh, outline will deal with issues um, such as um, you know, the pollution in uh, Lake Burien. Uh, it'll uh, deal with the slight dangers in uh, Seahurst graffiti bank repos and slum lower dwellings and just about everything else uh, because all of the problems ultimately uh, can be addressed by basically the, um, the four departments um, that the city manager oversees that would be finance, legal, planning, um, and public works. Um, and our current city manager's refusal to uh, follow the law it, it needs to be stopped, and if this cannot be done, then really uh, there is going to have to be, I believe, a change of the council, and I appreciate your time.